Hey guys, it's Haley, your nutritionist. We are here in my kitchen filming some really cool videos for our member community. And every time we get together and film videos and the cameras turn off, my team asks me questions. And this is a great one because it's actually a question that one of our community members asked that um, I haven't gotten around to writing a blog post about yet. So let's see if we can't wing this one. It's very interesting to me. Okay, this one comes from Debbie. If you lose the most weight on the cleanse, okay. Some on MR, okay. metabolism revolution, and just a little bit on the fast metabolism diet. What is your body telling you? Okay, that, I, that's actually, oh, I just want to science geek out. Okay, I'm going to try and take it slow here. That's a very fascinating question. So the 10-day cleanse really focuses on phase two of liver detoxification. So how the body takes fat-soluble toxins, or toxins in general, and helps to convert them into water-soluble toxins for excretion, as well as how it helps eliminate fat-soluble toxins by binding those substances and eliminating them through the bowels. Um, the metabolism revolution is a little further down the metabolic chain and it works more on um, mineral corticoids, the, the uh, class of hormones that regulate kind of what comes in and out of the cell, okay? And then the fast metabolism diet works more on glucocorticoids. So more the holistic uh, traveling of hormones throughout the body, how um, the liver uh, emulsifies fats, the gallbladder emulsifies fats in the small intestine, um, how the body regulates the hormone of insulin. So in this particular individual, when they're telling me that they lose the most on the cleanse, so that's when I help facilitate liver detoxification, they lose some on metabolism revolution. So remember, that's what allows stuff to come in and out of the cells, but not as much on the fast metabolism diet. Typically, that means to me that their body has somewhere along their journey been exposed to toxins. It can be, they can be um, candida, parasitic heavy metals. Those are the most common plastics. And those toxins have just kind of slowed down. So it's like trying to um, run through sludge, the metabolic rate. And so with those individuals, maybe it would be fun to play with one of the specialty cleanses. Um, and, and a lot of times we'll rotate those. We'll, if, if they want to get an impact, they want to do the fast metabolism diet and cycle the 223, and they really like the food, and that's a really good benefit because, again, it helps regulate the blood sugar. It helps regulate the histamine response in the body. They might want to layer in like metabolism metals or metabolism conditions or metabolism mycotoxin. Typically what we do is we rotate those. Remember candida or uh, fungal um, substances in nature, they're actually like sponges in the body. They actually hold on to toxins. So if we kill those off, we need a binding agent to excrete it out. So if you do like the metabolism candida or metabolism mycotoxin, you either want to follow that with metabolism metals or be on the metabolism cleanse because with the spirulina um, and, and the uh, phytonutrients that help absorb those toxins as they're released to get them on out through the bowel, um, you, you're supported there. So if I were going to do the metabolism uh, if this individual wanted to do the fast metabolism diet, I would have her layer in metabolism candida and metabolism metals, and I would actually rotate those every week. So I would do candida and mycotoxin for one week, metals the next, mycotoxin for one week, and candida, metals the next, through that whole 28-day cycle. And I bet that she would get a huge bang out of the fast metabolism diet. If she wants to juice up the um, metabolism revolution a little bit, so she gets as much of a bang that she does on the cleanse, the trick to that is to use the metabolism enzymes and the metabolism sneeze. And the reason why is because the metabolism sneeze helps to shrink the fat cells. So um, it's awesome because as they shrink, it actually helps create metabolism enhancing hormones and as fat cells get uh, taunt it actually creates hormones that slow the metabolism um, but then also the metabolism enzyme because like I was saying in the metabolism revolution program we're working on the mineral corticoids which help get things in and out of the cell and those proteolytic enzymes help not only break down kind of the um, hard structure of fat cells, but it also helps to create equilibrium or a balance in what we call the disodium pump or how the body regulates sodium and potassium interstitial, um, uh, intercellular and extracellular fluids. So 
that would be a great way to pump that up. And then if she cycled back around and did a 10 day cleanse, she would grab so much fat soluble toxins, it would be really awesome to see how her body responded to that type of nurturing.